Hey guys, finally we are with our Harrier. So we'll just take the tour of inside, how it looks like and uh, what are the different features which it has. Now, one thing which you can notice is the street noise and the noise which you will hear inside. It's pretty much silent. So that is a great thing about Harrier. About the doors, uh, they are pretty sturdy and when you will shut, they will have this loud third voice. The glove box or the glove compartment has uh, the light source as well, which is a nice touch. So the car has uh, the rear wiper as well, which is great. So this takes a while to understand, you know, the different wiper configurations. So the Harrier has the wiper configurations on the left and the indicators and the headlight uh, configurations on the right and uh, on the right there will be the electronically adjustable mirror in the xm model these are not electronically foldable so you have to do it manually and the driver's seat gets the controls for all the four power windows and there is this interesting switch which basically disables all the power windows so just in case you are having kids in your car then they will not be able to adjust the power window or use the power window at all these are the usual clutch brake and accelerator pedals and uh, this is the steering and these are the mats the fancy mats which i paid about i think 3000 4000 rupees for those uh, so these are called th 3d mats so all the dealers they will sell you these the hand brakes looks very interesting this looks like they have been taken from the aircraft so you just have to pull them or push them depending on how you want to use them now you can see the important parts of the car, so the infotainment system, the multi-drive mode. So it has the eco, city and sport and you can also see the AC controls. The car has uh, three USB ports, uh, two on the front and one on the rear. So this is the second port. And the third port is in the rear <laughs> so you can just see it hidden beneath yep so now you can see that and uh, in the rear as well you will get the power window controls for each of the passengers like that and uh, there are the speakers as well and also there is the AC vent in the rear and these are the lights for the rear passengers the sunglasses holder is on the top and uh, as you can see that and also there are Bluetooth mics which you can see and these are the lights and then there are the sun visors looks pretty new because I haven't taken the polythenes out of them for now and uh, there are some instructions about the airbag that don't keep kids uh, uh, front facing because there are airbags and the kids can get hurt really badly and also there is the airbag on the steering as well so there are airbags mentioned that okay this particular part has the airbag so this is the key and now we'll just switch on the car so you have to press the clutch first and then you can start you have the hand brakes ready
now we'll just talk a little about this uh, interesting switch which basically disables the power windows for all the passenger sides so basically it's uh, to prevent the kids to operate the power windows which uh, may result into some incidences so to prevent them we can just disable it uh, and the red light will not be on in that case so when dry red light is blinking it basically means that uh, anyone can operate the power windows but if it is disabled then no one can operate the power window so that is one of the safety uh, features of the car and uh, rest is uh, pretty uh, standard so yeah more or less you will find it in all the cars so it's more about the driving experience of the car and how big it is and uh, the capabilities of the car mainly but uh, features wise as as you will go uphill in the in terms of the models you will find more features uh, in the car so i hope you enjoyed this uh, tour of uh, the interiors of the car and one last thing so when you will just open the door you will find these or lights which basically glows in dark and it helps you find the path so yeah that was the tour of the Harrier Thank you so much for watching this video I hope you enjoyed it you can support this travel and exploration youtube channel by subscribing to it and sharing it with your friends and family thanks so much for watching